The Antarctic Snow Cruiser was a bold and innovative project designed to conquer the icy terrain of Antarctica. Built in just 11 weeks in 1939 after two years of design, it featured a control cabin for five crew members, a machine shop, kitchen, darkroom, and ample space for fuel and food. It even carried the Beechcraft biplane on its roof. The heated cabin used engine coolant, and its diesel-electric drivetrain was ahead of its time. However, the cruiser's promise quickly faded. On its maiden trip from Chicago to Boston, it veered off a bridge and was stuck in a stream for three days. Upon reaching Antarctica, the heavy vehicle collapsed the unloading ramp. Worse still, its large, treadless tires, ideal for swamps, were useless on snow. It sank almost a meter into the ice. Attempts to improve traction with chains helped only in reverse, making its longest Antarctic journey just 148 kilometers backwards. While briefly used for scientific work, it mostly served as living quarters. When World War II broke out, the project lost funding, and the vehicle was abandoned. 